Hey everybody, this is Mike at Klaassen Motorsports Fresno. Today we are gonna go over the Can-Am Maverick X3 Turbo RR XRS. This car is going to come with 200 horsepower from factory. It's also gonna sit 72 inches wide. That is beneficial when you're trying to get a bigger footprint out in the dunes or the desert. It makes you a little bit more stable when you're driving a lot faster. So definitely something you're gonna want if you're gonna be out there. In the XRS, it does come with beadlock wheels. It comes with retractable four-part harnesses, and it also comes with a roof. So that'll save you a little bit of money there. This car comes with Smart Shocks. Smart Shocks is only offered on one vehicle, which is gonna be the XRS Turbo RR with the Smart Shocks. So Smart Shocks is a function to where you can actually adjust the suspension electronically. Um, the car has sensors that are reactive all the way around it, and you're able to put it in comfort mode, you're able to put it in sport mode, you're able to put it in sport plus, or like I, I like to call it, super sport. A really good benefit to the XRS Turbo R, R with Smart Shocks um, is the bead locks. The bead locks are fantastic. I mean, if you wanna go rock crawling, if you wanna play around in the desert, but you don't necessarily wanna put paddles on your car, bead locks are great to have because if you don't wanna put paddles, you can just air down the tires and not worry about losing a tire if you air down a little bit too much. One of my favorite things on the Can-Am, uh, the XRS Turbo R with Smart Shocks, is gonna be the retractable harnesses. Now, these are very, very nice. Um, they're kind of expensive if you don't buy a car with them in it already. So the fact that the XRS comes with them in it is a definite plus and it's a four part harness system. So you're definitely secure. You don't have to worry about the kids flying out the window or anything like that. So inside here in the cab of the XRS, you're going to have a few different switches. Okay. Um, this car will have dynamic power steering is what Can-Am calls it. So you'll be able to adjust the amount of power steering that you receive from the steering module. Um, that's minimum, medium, or maximum. And that will be the amount of assistance that you get. Uh, also, I got these three switches here. So the car does have two wheel drive. It has four wheel drive, and it also has front diff lock. So front diff lock is really great in hairy situations. And on top of the front diff lock, they kind of stacked it with this trail active button. So they have trail, which is just what you would think it is, cruising through the trails. But when you lock the front differential and you throw the car into trail active, it allows you to drive the car a lot faster uh, with the front differential lock. So definitely a plus. If anybody's ever driven a four wheel drive truck, they know when they lock the front diff, they gotta drive slow. So, Definitely something cool, being able to drive a little bit faster with the front differential lock. The last switch is gonna be the Smart Shocks control switch. Just like I said before, it has three different modes. Comfort, comfort is gonna relax those shocks. It's gonna let that suspension droop so that you got a real cushy uh, bounce to it. Then Sport Mode's gonna tighten it up a little bit. It's for driving a little bit faster. And Sport Plus or Super Sport Mode um, is gonna really tighten them up because we're trying to race. We're trying to go fast. We wanna be quick and we don't want a lot of play in our suspension. So the XRS is comparable to the brand new Polaris Turbo R. Um, the Turbo R is a little bit wider, but it is definitely comparable to an XRS Turbo RR with smart shocks. So in the Polaris, you will have the same kind of system. They call it Dynamics. It's also a smart shocks kind of system. They do not come with bead locks on the Polaris. The Can-Am is, that's exclusive to the Can-Am. They come with bead locks in this model. Um, the Turbo R Ultimate will have four part or five part harnesses so that you can, you know, lock in and everything, make sure everybody's safe. Um, the look is really the main difference as well as the height when it comes to the Turbo R and the uh, XRS. So the height will help in various situations. You know, the higher you are, the less you're gonna, you know, more likely bottom out. So when you're driving fast and you're cruising through the desert and you're going through whoops and all that kind of thing, we do wanna be lifted up a little bit. That way we don't bottom out. Um, it does come with 32 inch tires on the XRS. Turbo RR will come with 32 inch tires. Um, really, really nice because the, the bigger the tire, the more meat that you have, the more shredding you can do through the dirt. Um, the Polaris Turbo R does come on 32s as well. So the A-Arms on the Can-Am XRS, um, they are a boxed A-Arm system, 
which is really, really nice. They're, they're pretty sturdy, so you shouldn't run into too many issues there. A lot of times in the past, you know, the A-arms really weren't built um, to take a beating, and now they are, so um, you have that boxed A-arm system. And the way that the shock is kind of lined out to the side at a 45 degree angle really allows in the Can-Am to have a lot more play in the suspension. So you get some more travel there, which is something you're really gonna want, especially in the desert or the dunes. The engine on the Can-Am is a three cylinder with a turbo. So that three cylinder with a turbo will pump you all the way up to 200 horsepower. Um, it is a very, very fast car. I know personally, my dad has an older can-am and it'll still do 90 so just imagine what this bad boy can do one thing that you can get on a can-am xrs is an audio roof this audio roof is going to have six speakers in it built-in bass and all that kind of stuff um, it can either hardwire in or you can bluetooth right to it they also offer a flip kit for the roof so being able to park it at camp and then flip the roof up like you see here and really just hang out and jam around the campfire and have a good time um, the speakers in the roof do have lights around them, so it looks really cool, you know, it's nice, it's fun. Um, and it is very loud. So uh, if you wanna hang out, you wanna rock and roll, or you wanna listen to whatever, the oldies but goodies, um, this bad boy's gonna do it. So in this particular Can-Am that I have on the floor here, uh, it does have a Rockford Fosgate Stage 6 audio system in it. What that means is it has 6.5 speakers in the front, it has eight inch speakers in the back. And it also has two subwoofers under both front seats. I believe they're 10 inch subs and she definitely will rattle some heads if you wanna rock and roll and you wanna be heard coming. The sound system is the way to go. They are marine speakers, so they're waterproof, all that kind of good stuff. So you don't have to worry about them getting wet or anything like that, it's gonna be fine. It does come with a 1500 watt amp and I would say that the probably the best two things about the sound system that you can get through Rockford Fosgate is gonna be the fact that there's no cutting um, to install the speakers and the dash and all that stuff. It literally comes with panels to replace the stock ones that will house the speakers. The second one is gonna be that this system is meant to run off the factory battery, the stock battery, and not kill it. So you can run this thing and it will not drain that battery till it's absolutely dead. So very, very cool feature there. Hope you like the tour of the Can-Am XRS Turbo RR with Smart Shocks today. Come on down, we look forward to seeing you at Clawson Motorsports Fresno.